They did everything. Everything is painted from the blue down. Chris Carney stands inside the gym of the Dunmore Community Center just before it was ready to reopen. We originally thought this wouldn't be open until the middle of April. And they worked, and there were guys here weekends, 12, 13 hours a day. On February 4th, the gym was closed down after it was discovered the facility's roof was never attached to the walls. <laughs> Contractors then came in and steel braces were installed. The gym was repainted. It is now back open for kids to play in and seniors to use. We have a number of people that walk in the gym in the morning and the weather hasn't cooperated for them to go out to the cemetery like they do when, when it's warmer. So they were excited to be in there this morning. And then, of course, our ballroom dance class has been like calling every week. Is it ready? Is it ready? After being closed for 49 days in all, the center's new executive director is expanding programs, offering kids the chance for more than just basketball after school. We have new dodgeball game. We have some scooters. We have some games that I used to do when I was teaching that are a lot of fun. The seniors are also hoping to use the gym more. They're looking to do programs for stay at home grandparents and maybe even create an over 50 basketball team. How many senior centers have a gym right on site or a playground right in the backyard? I mean, we're really fortunate to be here in Dunmore.